Hi, hello. How are you all doing? I hope you all are keeping great. So today, your Vindhya Mam, your VR Mam is going to reveal those important concepts of zoology which will make you to score at least one hundred. That is hundred out of one eighteen zoology. So without wasting much time, let's see most important concepts of zoology for your NEET twenty twenty five exam. Now. <coughs> Let's get started with the class 12 standard chapters and their important concepts. See, many of the chapters are high weighted chapter, but we can't predict which from which concepts uh, questions will be asked every time. But however, from some of the concepts, every year questions are asked, and that is why we are going to discuss these important uh, you know list of the concepts from which questions will be for sure asked every year in NEET exam. So the very first chapter is human reproduction. So in human reproduction. From gametogenesis, one question will be asked every year. Either match the following, or statement-based question, or a simple question uh, related to um, <coughs> spermatogenesis, oogenesis, or maybe the spermiation, spermatogenesis, spermiogenesis differences. All these things can be asked. And another question can be expected is from hormones. So there are different hormones that you get to see, uh, which has been produced at the different phases in the female's body as well as the male's body, like pregnancy hormones, their functions, estrogen. progesterone progesterone uh, testosterone so these hormones function will be for sure asked in the neat exam okay so the hormonal part of the chapter and from the gametogenesis one each question will be asked and then from reproductive health chapter from contraceptive so contraceptive is a very broad topic so for sure two one to two questions will be asked from this particular uh, concept so one is from gametogenesis <coughs> one is from gametogenesis one is from hormone one is from contraceptive sorry two is from contraceptive and one is from art assisted reproductive technology again in contraceptive please go through iud's very well because usually from this questions are been asked and coming to evolution in evolution they can ask any type of question and any uh, any concepts if you consider uh, questions are you know appearing Uh, in alternative year but from human evolution every year at least one question will be asked <coughs> and then coming to our highest weightage chapter of class 12 standard for your neat exam so the highest weightage chapter of class 12 which is highest weightage chapter of your neat exam is human health and diseases from here you can easily expect one or two questions from infectious diseases and one question from drug and one question from immunity immunity is again a broad topic but you can expect any sort of a question over here so infectious this is more important because one or two questions like uh, from plasmodium life cycle you can expect a question or from uh, any other infectious disease that has been given in a descript descri uh, descriptive way in this concept question can be asked and from the biotechnology principles and processes you can expect <coughs> question from vectors uh related to the features of the vector different types of vectors examples all these things i have not written many chapters name fully uh, i have written half but i hope it is clear it's biotechnology principles and process and then the last chapter of class 12 standard that is biotechnology and its application here lot of topics are quite important but usually questions are asked from bt cotton molecular diagnosis advantages of transgenic animal so for sure you can expect one question from vector and from these topics together you can expect around two questions okay advantages of transgenic animals as well like uh, which protein is being used to treat emphysema and uh, uh which is the uh, i mean also you should be knowing about that uh, human alpha lactal bivin protein right so all these concepts are important so these three concepts if you consider around two questions you can expect from this particular concept okay two to three i can say but yeah two is a safer number and from class 11 standard so you know now that from class 12 which is a highest weighted chapter one is human health and diseases another one is biotechnology principles and process even human production also has a good weightage but sometimes sometimes uh, uh, quite less number of questions are asked from this but in reproductive health more questions are asked so we can't talk about the weightage in this but for sure these two chapters are the high weighted chapter biotechnology principles and process and human health and diseases next next class 11 standard here which is highest weightage if you ask it's going to be animal kingdom and body fluids and circulation so from animal kingdom you need to remember all the examples with the scientific name and around two questions will be asked from this 
and also you need to know the unique feature and one question will be asked from this and structural or see even other type of questions can be asked but these are most expected because every year i am not cooking any story by looking at past 5 10 year question paper you yourself can make out whatever i am saying is true right and structural organization in animals so here every year questions are coming for sure from cockroach and tissues okay so tissues is a quite smaller topic so if you understand if you study the tissue uh, concepts like very well you can answer easily one to two questions from this particular chapter and the next chapter is breathing and exchange of uh, exchange of gases so from here uh, respiratory volumes and capacities from here questions are usually asked sometimes very rarely they won't be asking questions uh, uh, from this topic so i'm not going to write for sure uh, you know the number and next body fluids and circulation so every year questions are asked from ecg one question from ecg one question from uh, different cells of the blood and later other questions you can expect about the disorder or sometimes about the cardiac cycle but from these topic for sure questions are asked and next excretory products and elimination from here uh, from the different parts of the nephron they are function and urine formation so from these combined you can expect one question and then other lot of topic you have in this chapter uh, other organs uh, for excretion and uh, types of nitrogenous waste so from here as well question can be expected but for sure from these topic one question will be asked and then from locomotion every year questions are asked from types of joints and you should also know muscle contraction and about the skeletal muscle because combined one question will be asked from this and then neural control and coordination so from neural control and coordination from types of nerves neurons every year question is been asked and from chemical coordination and integration at least one question will be asked from disorder and biomolecules is a very important and high weighted chapter apart from other two chapters of class 11 standard so from here a lot of things can be asked but for, from enzyme for sure question will be asked one or two questions so hence this is an important topic so uh 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 around uh 26 27 questions i have listed so even if you consider 25 25 into 4 that is around 100 marks you can easily score from these important concepts by studying only this important concepts as well okay so i hope this video is helpful i hope you would be first going through first you will be studying these concepts very well because from these concepts guaranteedly questions are asked for the neat exam in zoology so i hope this video is helpful let's meet in the next class next video until then bye bye